So have you noticed any issues with your car lately? Maybe it's making a noise when you start it up, if it even starts up at all. We've had such cold weather. Well, guess what? If it's happened to you, you are not alone. Local mechanics are saying the cold might be the reason that your car needs to come to their shop. WMAR2 News Janae Wright spoke with a few of them tonight about the common issues they see and what you can do to prepare your car for more snow and cold that we're getting right around the corner tonight, according to Chris tonight. All right, I'm one. I'm one of the people who's not looking forward to that. But from auto body repair at, from accidents to repairs from freezing temperatures like we've been experiencing, mechanics are seeing it all. And with the temperatures dropping drastically, they feel most of the issues are preventable. Maryland is seeing one of the coldest weeks in just over a year, paired with its first significant snowfall in two years. But none of those things stops us from driving. Stephen Green with Paintless Dent Doctor says there are things you need to check before getting on the road because the cold temperatures can impact them. Some of the basic things you can do is uh, the treading on your tires. You can check those. Uh, you can check the uh, condition of your windshield wipers and also your battery, which is key in the winter months because you can lose literally 30 to 60 percent of its capacity during the winter time just due to the cold weather. So Tom Stafford with Tires and Timonium says even if you go to a mechanic regularly, there's a list of things to check often throughout the year, especially when the weather gets really cold. Your battery, your fluids, your tires, your brakes, all that's critical. Just if you if you stay ready, you don't have to get ready. Mechanics say it's very important to check the quality of your tires because having good tires can lower the risk of sliding or hydroplaning on icy roads. You should have like an all season tire, something that's good year round. We don't get that much snow up here. So it's not like, you know, that's you got to go get snow tires. You don't need that. That's a little uh, expensive and extravagant, but just good all season tires. Stafford says they've seen more cars this week because of the snow. You know, and then after the storm, then there's always the, you know, the damages to where somebody lost control, hit a curb. Stephen says it's also important to check the oil when the temperature drops, even in between oil changes. Oil thick thickens when the weather drops, when the temperature drops. So re regular oil changes are imperative when it comes to making sure your vehicle is in peak performance in the wintertime. And mechanics also advise that you clear the hood and roof of your car of any snow so that that ice doesn't break off and hit other drivers. And even if you don't have to drive anywhere for a few days, it's still a good idea to get the snow off of your car as soon as possible. Kelly. All right, Janine, I'm glad you brought that up. So how much of your car do you clean up when it snows? It looks like most of you is at 88% saying that they uh, clean it out, which is the best thing to do. I don't know if that 88% number is true, though. But you can weigh in at WMAR2news.com slash my vote because I saw a lot of snow on cars when I came into work today.